Hi, I'm Anna and we're from Middlesbrough College Northern Skills Group. My job role is ensure all employers are connected to a digital apprenticeship account and assist with the continued use of this. Previously, the apprenticeship service was only available to large employers to help manage their apprenticeship levy. But going forward, any company that wishes to recruit an apprentice or upskill assistant staff will be expected to have an account. Your account will mean you can reserve funding for up to three months in advance, recruit apprentices and add apprentices details onto your account. Although it may look daunting, it's actually quite simple. This is a step-by-step -step guide of how to set up and manage your own digital account. The website link to set up your own DES account can be easily accessed by googling Manage Apprenticeships and clicking on the link Create an account to manage apprenticeships. The first step to setting up an account will ask for basic information such as your name and email address. Your email address will be used as your username to log on. Then we'll ask you to set a password. This password must contain upper and lower case at least one number. It may be worth keeping a note of your password as this will be needed every time you log on to your account. Alternately, we can keep your login details on record and I can assist with any problems you may have with your digital account. Once you've completed this first stage, you'll receive an email from gov.uk with a six-digit activation code. You'll need to input this code into the website before you can go any further. Next, it'll ask you to add a PYE scheme. This can be done one of two ways. Firstly, you can use your government gateway login details linked to the company. Alternately, you can add a PYE scheme using the company's PYE number and account office reference number. PYE numbers can usually be found on pay slips and your account's office reference number should be on the top of any letters from HMRC. It will then present your company's details and ask you to confirm these are correct. The next page will give you the chance to read and accept the employer agreement. This step can be skipped initially, however you'll not have access to your account homepage until you've accepted this. Once you've accepted the employer agreement, you'll be presented with the homepage of your digital account. In the future, to access your account, you can type into Google, Manage Apprenticeships and click on the same link as previously. There is an option to sign in. Your login details consist of your email address and password that you set earlier. The top section of your homepage will be titled Apprenticeships. Under this section, you can add your company's apprentices under the Apprentices tab. Currently, there's only the option to add new and recently recruited apprentices. There's also a link for recruitment. Under this, you can add an advert for an apprenticeship directly to the National Apprenticeship Service. Please note that you can still choose to recruit through our recruitment service at Northern Skills. If so, you will not need to do anything regarding recruitment on your account. There's another link called Training Provider Permissions. Here, you can add Middlesbrough College as your training provider and set permissions. For example, you can give us permission to add apprentices' details on your behalf. You can add as many training providers in this section as necessary. Next to this is a section called Find Apprenticeship Training. Here you can search for all the apprenticeship training the government offers, find out what would be useful for your organisation and view which training providers offer this training. The next section down on your homepage is titled Finances. Under this section you can reserve funding for future apprenticeships and view your financial transactions with training providers. The next section down from this is titled Account. Under this section you can add other members of your team to your digital account and control what access they have. Also under this section you can add connected organisations to your account. For example, if you have a parent company, they can be added here. Your digital account should be fairly straightforward to set up and use. Until you plan on recruiting new apprentices in the upcoming months, there's nothing further you need to do on your account. If you wish to give us permission, I can reserve funding and add apprentices on your behalf. If you have any problems setting up or managing your account, please don't hesitate to contact me. I'm happy to set this up on your behalf or go through this with you over the phone. My email address is anna.gorman at northernskills.co.uk